okay so let's understand the fuzzy logic controllers implementation on dc dc buck converter here instead of using a constant dc voltage i am using variable input voltages to show you that the convert that the controller that you design is robust and it can handle all the voltage variations now here it is a power electronic switch inductor and diode the configuration of buck converter is capacitor this is the load i am taking these two uh, meters to uh, detect the state of the system that what is the current and voltage of the system and here i am taking the reference output voltage as 12 and then here it is generating the error and then error is going here this is the normal error signal and this is the rate of change of error signal uh, here this is the memory block which is storing the error of previous time instant so this is uh, let's say for time instant t then this is the error for time instant t minus 1 it is storing previous value and then giving at uh, time t so it is generating rate of change of error so both inputs are going in here what is happening here i will explain uh, come here here it is uh, going the output is uh, generated by fuzzy control going is here and then it is added in here with the small change of d and this small change of d is going uh, added up again and again and then it is coming up into the pwm generator depending upon the duty cycles value the pulses will be generated which will ultimately control the complete buck converter so okay let's come to these three constants this this and this these three values varies depending upon the system configuration if you will change your system configuration for let's say some different operating point different reference point if you will need different uh, inductors or capacitor values then you have to tune these values for them now what is happening into this fuzzy logic controller block uh, right now there is nothing nothing stored in it i have stored previously but let's say if you will use a new block then there will be nothing here so how to generate this as i have already created the file you will type it uh, fuzzy in the command window this block will open here uh, the videos that i provided into the description the links you can uh, go to those videos and understand that how do we design the input parameters here this is the rule base this is the output parameters so i already have the values so i will just import it from my system this is the fuzzy file that i have created okay so i am using error and change in error output and then my rule base okay so let's see the memberships of uh, my two inputs and one output uh, the membership that I used is I have already shown in the previous slides or anyway I will upload these files into the MATLAB so you can uh, see all these values there uh, for now I will not go into too deep so these are the values and here this is the rule base basically this is the heart of the controller here you decide that uh, depending upon the combinations of error and change in error what should be your output that is what should be the output of your controller then it will ultimately go into this block and this block will defuzzify it so i have shown you that how you can make these kind of rules for your system how you decide that if your system you have to understand your system in linguistic form that how it behaves and depending upon that uh, understanding you generate these rules okay so now how to use this we will simply export this to the workspace using this name for all so here you can see that this file is generated so now we will go to the simulation again and here we will type the, na the name which is stored in the workspace then we will type ok then we will run the system ok i will provide bug boost and bug boost 
all the three controllers so that you guys can look uh, the working of a zero z controller on all three converters here it started operating as i told you that we have a reference voltage equal to 12 so it will try to reach that as it is running very slow so i will not run it for the whole time just when it will reach the 12 and try to stabilize i will st uh, stop it Okay, I, I have also provided in the description one paper that I have written uh, that is my conference paper I have written on these topics also so that paper also you guys can ref, uh, refer for more details uh, theoretical details of physiology controller I have not provided mathemat too much mathematics into that also because uh, as I told you that uh, mathematics is only needed when you guys uh, try to uh, improve the performance of the fuzzy logic controller and uh, here as you can see that the task my task was just to implement the fuzzy logic controller on a particular system for that as you know that I have just learned the theoretical concepts like how it works how I can uh, design the rule base how I can select the input values and output values and how I can set ranges for all them and then how I can implement it in the MATLAB so that's all you guys also need to worry about okay so it is getting stable it is the output is stable now okay you, you have the files so you guys can run it on your own and check for the complete solution so that's all from me thank you guys